What's up, guys? Kevin Ty here, the Heroes and Brews podcast, back for another week. And what that usually means is there's a new beer of the week. B-O-T-W, y'all. And Ty, what are you drinking this week, my friend? We're drinking Neshaminy Creek uh, County Line IPA. We've had Neshaminy before. If you've watched in the past, we've had Keep It On The DL and the infamous John Juicy Ale with Nugget. Uh, We're coming back hard with this one because we had off last week. You know, this is Beer of the Week 101. The first one after 100. Number CN, as you can say in (laughs) Espanol. Um, (laughs) The first time I've had this, though, it was at Maniac Brewfest. And it's a good good IPA. Uh, Very good West Coast. Um, I rated it a 3.75 on the untapped. And, you know, it's not my favorite, but it's still very good and easy West Coast to drink. Same, dude. I, this was probably one of the first that I can remember West Coast style IPAs that I've ever had. Um, I, I enjoy the Chamonix Creek. They're out in, in Croydon, uh, Croydon, Pennsylvania. It's uh, like Lower Bucks County area. And they also have a restaurant that I may or may not have talked about before uh, in Jenkintown, PA, um, called Burrow Brew House. Um, that I actually nominated for Diners, Drivers, and Dives. <laughs> you, you nominated it? Yeah, dude. Well, first off, I'm proud of you for nominating a brewing company, but yeah, I'm man. upset. Well, it's, a you... rest- it's a restaurant, too. You know, so. Yeah. But it's all in that Shabbat Creek beer. But yeah. yeah. It's a brew pub. Or, no. Nah. See, this is where I get confused. Is it? It's not really a brew pub, right? Because it's like a restaurant slash brewery. I would what call is it. that called? Oh, if it, if it houses. You know, one type of brewing, like one brewing company, I would say it's a brew pub because it's supporting one brewing company and it's yeah. selling food. Brew pub. I probably should have researched this beforehand, but someone can comment and let me know exactly what that would be considered. Anyways, the food's fantastic. The beer's fantastic. They actually have a IPA that they just brew for the Jenkintown location, which is called Color Day IPA, which is kind of reminiscent of County Line IPA. Okay. But I will say, the County Line IPA has way more of a bite to it. It does, yeah. Than the Color Day IPA, which is still a West Coast style, but it's not as intense. And I, that's something about the Chamonix Creek, the County Line IPA, that has always stuck with me is it's always had this this little kick, you know, at the end. And I enjoy that, but some people might not. Um, but uh, it's definitely it's definitely one of my favorites. Uh, I think I say that all the time, bro. I, hey, shit, like, you know what I mean? Like, if you make good beer, you're going to be my favorite. Um, and the Chamonix Creek usually doesn't disappoint. Um, so that's a beer of the week, man, and I'm, yeah, I'm this... stoked. And I'm sad um, because when I was on Long Island, Court and I were drinking. We found Artisanal Brewing Company. They have this yeah. Warhead four-pack of, like, this Warhead beer. It's, it's all like sa- the sour candies? Oh, yeah. They had black oh, cherry, man. watermelon, um, black cherry, watermelon, blue raspberry, and uh, sour apple. Dude, it's so good. I don't know if you would like it, but yeah. the hints, like the taste of the warheads they were going for, were spot on. I just wish they had the traditional lemon warhead. They do, but it wasn't in that little design four pack that they sold. Mm. I, you know what? I think I would just have to try it. Yeah. Uh, just because, uh, I, I, believe it or not, I used to be a fan of the Warhead candies. I think you, you would know? like these beers then. Um, I, it just, yeah, it's just sour beers. I mean, I, I appreciate them. And I could probably have one, but I think that's where I stop. I don't think I could, like, chill on a sour beer all night yeah. like some people could. Well, I but. think, as a video idea, we should do a taste test. Court and I were going to do it, but we didn't have a setup. We didn't have a camera, and I'm like, lost cause. For yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I definitely have to give him a shot, man. We got, we'll have to get some and, and bring him on the show.